with Ziva Dos Cabos. Hi mga bes, welcome to our channel. This is Zane and I will be taking you back to Cabo, Mexico. This episode we show you what Hyatt Ziva offers as an all-inclusive resort as well as take you on a land and sea excursion to see the Arch of Cabo San Lucas. We loved our stay here and we hope you enjoyed watching. If you do, please hit the like and subscribe button below for more content like this. views we've ever seen. Check-in was a breeze with a margarita on arrival. So we are going to do a room tour. We just got here at Hyatt Ziva. And so this is a Club King room. So when you come in, there's the this little foyer place, I guess. And you can get this connecting if you want with your family. So you have a little mirror there. You have a little um, snack bar here, all complimentary. So when you come in, you got a king sized bed there and then your oh, program of entertainment some storage areas and the little seating area here and we've got our bathroom over there look at that so you gotta save Ooh, and we have bathrooms very big um, closet space here. Some storage space there too. And we've got a tub in here. here. And we call we have what they call a Juliet. Juliet balcony. Um, which is this it's a little balcony, it's not like a huge one where you can actually sit, but you can open it and See, enjoy the views of the pool and the ocean front. So I believe this this is actually the Sea of Cortez. It's not the Pacific like the Hard Rock. Oh, look at that. Still a beautiful view of the ocean. And this is a huge pool. It goes all the way up there. Very pretty. So we are here for four nights five days we are very excited about this so yep so someone just knocked on our door and saying there's a gift for us and came in with a bottle of wine tequila and some truffles so I'm like mm, can this thing get any better baby cabanas for an extra charge and then some day beds out here too hi baby <laughs> now chilling we are in Hyatt Ziva this is the big pool we are in right now Look what he's got. Cheers! Ah, no, salud, salud. <laughs> Infinity 
Alright, we're just having water. Your water is so warm. It's crazy. It's like me and the hotel. Hot tub. Without being in a hot tub. Without being in a hot tub. This is supposed to be a thing. I don't So we got a view of the beach. So they're doing something over there. I don't know what. But yeah, you can get like special dinner, romantic dinner. You can rent out the car. But yeah, that's what we've been doing all afternoon. Drinking our life. I think mine ended after that. Finish. <laughs> The next morning, it was time to go out for an all-day excursion. It was a beautiful day. We drove down to Cabo San Lucas on an excursion arranged by the hotel. So you thought you got it made for Easy living slipping out the back door This is a tour boat we were gonna spend a day in. There's nothing that is too late for Our primary destination for the day In the is the Arch of Cabo San Lucas. This is a rock formation at the tip of the Baja Peninsula where the Pacific Ocean meets the Sea of Cortez. As you can see, it's a popular tourist spot and they say that it is also a favorite hangout of sea lions. We didn't see one today, but we're happy to see this tourist spot because word has it that due to weather conditions, erosion has already begun inside its structure. One day, this arch may collapse.
end of your day, it's time to explore the dining and entertainment options that they have at this hotel. They have multiple restaurants with different cuisines. Zafiro was a pleasant surprise. We didn't plan to eat Italian food in Mexico, but we overslept one afternoon, ended up here, and we loved the food and experience. We also enjoyed La Hacienda for the delicious food and awesome beachfront ambiance. We loved our little date night dinner here. Don't forget room service. We had a feast one morning. It was during this trip that I discovered my love for chilaquiles. This is a list of all the other restaurants that they have. They also have snack bars and cafes that offer food during the day. Hyatt Siva offers a variety of different entertainment every night. We watched a fun 80s show. And of course, YMCA never dies. But we saved their best entertainment for last. They called it Viva Mexico and it was so much fun. They had food, music, dancing, and culture all together. We can't have thought of a better way to spend our last night here than to experience this. It was amazing. And that wraps up our Cabo vacation at Hyatt Siva. I hope you enjoyed watching. Don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, and bell button below to follow us along on our adventures. Next episode, Artie and Lou will take you along on their trip to Houston, Texas. As always, sprinkle kindness, share the love, and we are living the best life.